Hello. Uh, in this video, I'm going to show you how to uh, log into WordPress and uh, send out a newsletter to uh, subscribers. Okay, first of all, you go to the uh, website. Okay. okay, and then you uh, make a slash wp admin enter. Enter in your username and password and click log on. Okay, once you log into um, the admin, you click on K News. Okay, this is a plugin that I install uh, with WordPress and uh, it allows you to um, send out newsletter. Okay, so uh, here are some options. Uh, let's select newsletters. Okay. okay, now here are some newsletter that I've sent out uh, June and July. Um, here's a, a template. So let's make a copy. Click on duplicate. This template. Okay, now let's rename it. Okay, um, give it a name. Let's, let's name it a test okay. a demo. Let's do demo. Okay, click on rename. Okay, and then after that, you click on edit. Right here. Okay, here is the uh, newsletter. So now we're gonna add uh, some uh, messages. Okay, some some posts uh, to it. And uh, right here, we can drag this, make it bigger, so we can see. Okay. Okay, so there's a different kind of format um, of the messages we want to put in the newsletter. So this is the one that I use. Okay, so just drag it over and put it between the red and the gray. So let go. Okay, what you do is you click and then you drag over and then you let go uh, of the button and it appear right here. Okay, so now notice right here the W. You okay, can click on that W to insert a post. All right, now here are some messages. Okay, some posts. Um, I think it's put in um, order from current to uh, the older one, so you can select that or you can move on to the next page by clicking that arrow okay whenever you click on that somehow it defaults to the Vietnamese one so um, you know if you don't want that you know click on the English so it will display all the English one. okay now uh, I'm gonna select this one okay uh, just click on that okay so now I have uh, one message in there and if I want to add another one then I do the same thing I click right over here hold it down the button and then drag over and then you can put it under it or on top of it however you want okay so I just put it under that okay now click on the W again okay and I just select uh, another message. Okay. So I select this one. Okay. All right. 
So, um, and I can change the pictures, okay? Um, I can click on that, and then click on this icon right here to change pictures, okay? So, right here in the media library, I can select one of the pictures that, that was already uploaded already. I can use one of them, okay? So I can click on that one. And then I click right here under here set insert into pose. Okay. All right, now I click on that. So let's say um, you are in image edition mode. You must press apply, okay, before doing anything else. So uh, it wants you to um, save it. So click OK and click on apply changes. Okay. Okay. So now click on this and then click on that icon again. Now you can select from here or you can upload your own file. So you can, you can click right here, upload files, select files, click on that, and then pick, uh, select the picture, click OK, open. Okay, so that picture is uploaded. Click on insert into pose. Notice there's a check mark right there. Yeah, so that, that one is selected. Click, click down here, insert into pose. Okay, so now if you want to change the color of the background, you can do that. Um, let's see, actually, let's apply changes first. Okay, click on that. Okay. Now over here you can change uh, the background color. This third one, um, you highlight over it. It, it tells you uh, what it, what it is that you want to change. This is background color. This is the background color one that corresponds to this one right there. And uh, the great title, which is this. Okay, and uh, the title color, which is that one right there. Okay. And this text color, which is the text right here, but um, let's change the background color. Okay, you can click on this one, but uh, somehow the color picker is not working, so we just have to do the work around. Let's close that. Um, we can click on HTML right here and edit the code directly. Okay, now. Okay, so we want to change that blue background color, and uh, the blue background color is this right here. Okay, so I'm going to copy that. Um, I just do a search. Okay, in your browser, you should be able to do a search. In, I'm using Chrome, so click on that and click on Find. Okay, just paste it in there. Okay, so it's fine right there. Okay, let's replace those two with the tan color, which is this, this one. Here. This is the tan color. Okay, um, so let's delete that one and paste that tan color for that one and do the same thing for this pattern. Okay, now at the bottom, just click on close and save changes. Okay. All right, so uh, if you want to edit some more, then click on this, and if we're done, and just click on submit newsletter. Okay, and submit newsletter. All right, so right here, I have uh, two lists, okay, the main one. Um, NRTTE mailing list. That one is the one that uh, that is the actual one with all the subscribers to it. Okay, and uh, the test list. Um, you know, we can test. I think I just have my name in it, and, uh, and I can add whoever in it too. But I'm just testing, so let's check. But uh, if you send it out, you know, the actual one, then check this one. 
But otherwise, uh, if you just test and you just check that, and uh, okay, you actually can state you know when you want it to submit it. You can leave it as is, and then click on schedule submit. Um, okay, and you actually can send instead of sending to the list, you can just manually send it to whoever, and then you, by typing right here and submit. Okay, so let's click on this one. Okay, it's been processed. So it should send out very shortly. Okay, so um, that's pretty much it. And once you're done, you can click what's that? highlight over there, over here, and uh, click log out.